Well, Coach, if you could uh, introduce yourself and give us a little background, okay? Okay. My name is Kristen Detterman. I teach kindergarten here in Sac Center. This is my first year as a head track coach. I've been an assistant here for two years. Um, originally from Long Prairie, so from the area. Kind of been competing against Sac Center, and now it's kind of nice coaching for them, getting a different feel for it. All right. I noticed, too, that you have a lot of athletes out, boys and girls. Uh, what are the numbers like, and how's that been? Uh, it's pretty good numbers this year, actually. Um, in our varsity, we've got close to 50. That's 9 through 12, and we've got about 30 in our 7th and 8th grade for junior high. And you, like all the other spring coaches, I, I'm sure would love to get outside, but so far, what have you been doing with the track team? We've been doing a lot of workouts inside, um, just for the fact that it's been really cold. Actually, tomorrow, I think we're going to start inside and then head outside for our running just on the tar parking lots or on the streets, being careful, of course, but wanting to get out onto a track, the brand new track, of course, too. <laughs> Yeah, you know, as you mentioned that too, uh, what are you doing with the new track? I, you know, just wait for it to melt? That's kind of the plan for this year. I know some areas have done where they do shoveling, but we thought with the new track, it's, it's so brand new, we would hate to damage it, um, especially because the lines aren't even done yet. So the plan now is to wait for it to melt and then hopefully get on it as soon as we can. Before school is out, right? <laughs> yes, I, I, I'm hopefully, I don't want to say I can guarantee it, but we hopefully will be on it and able to use it. We'll be able to use it before the lines are painted, but I know that the, wa the weather has to be warm before that they can do that. Okay, as you mentioned, uh, 50 athletes out. I don't want to go through all the names, but can you just highlight some of the girls and some of the boys that are maybe back from last year and, and what you might expect out of them? Yes, we have um, quite a few uh, returning athletes. There's only a few senior girls. We have Macy Weller and Ashley Coleman. Um, there's a couple other ones on there, but those kind of come to mind right away. Um, we have three boys coming back from our state relay team last year, so that's kind of a positive. Plus, we've had a couple of seniors that join, which is nice, too. So we And uh, Thomas Schwinghammer and Jacob Minswar and Keenan Pearson on that relay team. Um, so hopefully looking for some fast relay sprints as well. Um, and with our long jumpers, we had Thomas Schwinghammer go to state last year in long jump. And I'm hoping to see good things from him in long jump and triple jump. And Macy Weller again went to state last year in triple jump. So I'm hoping to see good things there too. Yeah, when you talk about Macy Weller, that's certainly an athlete that we know very well. Uh, talk about her a little bit and what she means to the track program, not only in volleyball and basketball, but what does she mean to this track team? It's so, it's so nice to have an athlete like Macy. Um, it's so nice I can have her try different things and things come pretty easy to her, but she also works very hard. So it's nice to see the kids follow in the footsteps of somebody who's going to really dedicate themselves to a sport. And to be a three-sport athlete is very tough. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because I, I suppose she could have wrapped it up, right? And, but yet she's still out there competing. I think, you know, last year was the first year she made it to state individually. She had gone previously with relay teams and different things. But last year, you know, to get there on your own, nobody else was helping you. I don't think she's done. I think she wants to try it again this year. It would be nice to do a repeat. All right. Well, good luck. We'll follow along, okay? Thank you very much. All right. Thank you, Coach.